athlete's going to start with their foot in the center of the star. Their heel is going to be placed right on that piece of tape. They're going to take the bar and place it right across their pelvis. They're going to step their foot around as far as they can go, measuring internal rotation range of the stance leg. But wait, you have to look to see if there's any compensations. And here you can see that he's excessively rotated and he's now supinated and his first MTP is lifting off the ground. So you have to reset the technique and look for any of those compensations. Another compensation that may occur, they may flex their knee. Or another one that may occur, they may excessively adduct the opposite side femur, the one that's not their stance leg. So you'll make those corrections, and Aaron, this time make sure that you press your big toe into the ground as you step around. You'll have the athlete then step around again, looking for any of those compensations, and then you'll come in with your secondary dowel. You'll make a measurement that is perpendicular to the first dowel. You can take that piece of tape and mark that spot. You'll then take the goniometer that you have. You'll line up the stationary arm with the perpendicular line on the ground. You'll put the axis directly over the blue piece of tape where the heel was, and you'll move the moving arm so it's directly in line with the piece of tape that you measured. I'll go ahead and remove that goniometer and make a reading. And we have 22 degrees. So Aaron went from zero to 22 degrees of functional hip internal rotation on his right side. 